Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, please subscribe. So I'm gonna jump right into this nail tutorial. Right now I'm gonna be applying my peel off pop off base coat because this is a practice set and I only wanted to wear these nails for about two days and they lasted a good, I wanna say three. So yeah, um, but jumping right into it, we're gonna be reviewing IGL Beauty. Um, their acrylic line. This is the Diamond Dip and Dap Ombre Collection. And these two shades, um, I believe 44 and number 27, these are the only two shades I'm going to be using from them today. Basically, I have a ton of IGL Beauty that's been sitting, y'all, for years. Okay, like I remember purchasing these like in the beginning of my uh, nail journey and I was so freaking excited and you know, like we've all been there. Okay, the very beginning, you're super excited and you just want to splurge like you want to buy that you want to buy this. And let's just say I really did it with IGL Beauty because I believe I have like 50 or so like colored acrylics from them and they just sat and i'm just like why am i not using this stuff so basically i just wanted to like you know pull it out of the vault and give it a try so yeah we testing it out today um i just want to say that i did not use igel beauty's monomer for um, this set, okay? Uh, I don't have IGL Beauty's monomer or else I would have used it. <laughs> but I will be buying IGL Beauty's monomer because I wanna see what it's like um, to use their monomer that is actually formulated for their acrylic powders, okay? So today, in this tutorial, I actually use Hot Tips Beauty. It's not even a monomer that I usually use. However, I was running super low on my Young Nails monomer and I wanted to save that in case like, you know, I needed it for a client or something, which I ended up needing that um, before my new batch came in. So I wanted to do this practice set using like some practice monomer basically but as far as like application and everything i really feel like it still worked out which is pretty cool like i feel like they are actually pretty easy to work with i feel like um as far as like them having this ombre line i'm not really sure what that means i can't remember what that means and um I'm not going to say that it was hard to ombre, but I wouldn't say that it was much easier than any other colored acrylic. Again, I am not using the monomer that is formulated for their line, so it could have a lot to do with that. Um, now, once I do get the monomer that um, is formulated for their line, the iGel Beauty monomer, I will be doing another true review because um, I want to see the difference, you know? So I want to see the difference, me working with this monomer, or even the Young Nails monomer, because Young Nails claims that they are universal, I believe. And so far during this whole nail journey, Young Nails has been my go-to because they are universal and they seem to work with every single um, brand that I've used, which I find very, very impress impressive so yeah anyway today i'm going to be doing a valentine's day set i didn't want to use like the traditional colors you're always going to see your pinks you're always going to see your reds but i was like what are these colors because <laughs> i for some reason bought a lot of like cool tone or like muted weird colors from IGL Beauty and they're not ugly they're just like not your average and I'm so for it though I'm so for it because I love colors like this so like this khaki color and this uh lilac almost gray color like I was just like this is it this is it like I really like it so 
I hope you guys do too. Anyway, I'm just going to be using these two shades from them and everything else. Um, I will have either on the screen or in the description or both. And yeah, but as far as working with I Gel Beauty in this tutorial, in this set, I would say that it was pretty easy to work with. I would say that um, with any new acrylic powder, you're gonna have to like get to know it, okay? So it's always, it's oh, I find it that it's always like that first nail, that's your like basically your practice nail. Whether you use a swatch stick or whether you use it, you just go right into your set. You're always going to like use that first nail as your test nail because like you got to see like, can I play around with this? Can how, like how fast is it set? Um, does it work well with this monomer? So on and so forth, you know, but I would say like as far as like getting to know this acrylic powder it wasn't it didn't take much it didn't take much i found it to be a little bit on the runny side but knowing that and then as i started to dry my beads because of that it works a lot better you know so it's like all about getting to know and getting to work with the acrylic powder i feel like um you know, as you grow in your nail journey, like it's probably like one of those things like you can put any acrylic powder in front of you and work with any acrylic powder. You just have to know how to use it. You know, like, I don't know. I, I don't know if that makes sense. Like, anyway, um, basically, I like IGL Beauty. I am actually pretty interested and I think if you're a beginner and you actually want to like um, build your collection that this might be the way to go because I do remember I gel beauty is pretty affordable I would say they're pretty affordable I would say that they have a lot of variety to offer I will also say that they have really good sales. I remember buying all of these colored acrylics like on sale. I can't remember exactly what sale, but I remember getting a really good deal. So it might be worth checking out. All right. Um, but basically, that's all I have to say. <laughs> so I'll be getting off of here to let you guys finish this nail tutorial. Everything else that I used in this set will be link down in the description box or shown on the screen thank you guys so much for watching thank you guys so much for always leaving me these dope sweet comments like you have no idea how much that means to me like they are seriously like everything and just give me the motivation that i need to keep going to keep going like for all of these videos for all of these nail tutorials like just my nail journey so you guys are very appreciated if you're new here and if you like what you see hit the subscribe button help my channel grow like watch my nail journey flourish and yeah um i'll be back soon i have so many videos that uh, i need to post so yeah i'll see you guys soon take care